Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. Your medicine. This is Boma. No ma. Sorry, oh, sorry. Thank you. And it's very delicious. All for you, Mama. Thank you. I just want you to eat it, take your medication before your children return. Hmm? I, I don't will. want them to come back and meet you like this. I don't want it. I will. Oh. Hmm? What will I have done without you? <laughs> Amen. Amen. Oh, so this is where you are. Instead of preparing food for myself and your younger brother who just came from the farm. Really? So this is what you have become? Papa, I'm sorry. I'm coming home to do that. She's not feeling very well and she's the only one at home. Her children went to the farm. Please. I thought my business. No. Nice. Because it is, she's right. It's my fault. I asked her to come and assist me. Don't please, be angry. Please, Papa. Woman, stay out of this. Stay out of this. How can you be talking to me? Who are you? Oh, you are your son. I don't know what you gave to my daughter that has made her lose her sanity. But let me tell you. No, 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 look at her. She has removed... lost every sense of belonging. Removed... How can somebody that is normal leave her house in the morning without preparing food in her house but came to a stranger's place? Is it normal? But whatever it is you have given to her, Beat it out of her eyes. I promise you that. <laughs> I'm fine. You're welcome. Yes. Sit. Has it been long you returned from the farm? Yes. And I saw the fantastic, awesome jollof fries you prepared for my mom. <laughs> and you know, my mother told me how you took care of her. Nee, thank you so much. It's nothing. She's also my mother. I, I felt very bad when I walked in here and found out that she was sick. Mm. So I did what I could do to make her feel better. Thank you. Thank How is you. she now? Ah, she's fine. Oh, thanks to you. You did the magic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that reminds me. Amara told me what your father did to my mother. Why, why would your father do a thing like that now? It, it's not fair. You see, I, I, I really... I'm I feel... sorry, Obi. I'm so sorry. My father didn't mean to. The fault was mine. I did not make anything for him to eat and my younger brother before coming here. So when they came back from the farm, they didn't find anything to eat. That was the anger he bounced on your mother. But to be honest with you, he's deeply sorry. He later regretted everything he said. Once again, I apologize on his behalf. I'm sorry, Obi. No, it's okay. It's okay. I, I forgive him. Hmm? But it's because of you. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's okay. But you know I don't joke with my mother. That's I don't I joke like with her either. I don't. I love mama. I know. <laughs> okay, let's play Rido. I'll give you 10 zero. Ta, I'm <laughs> I'm making my bring the Rido 6 zero. I'll give you back to back. Uh -huh. Wait, it's good I met you here. Amarachi, what would it profit you if Oketuku should dislike my father? I don't understand. How will you understand? You will not obviously understand because you are dumb. Please don't even give me that serpent's pretense. You went and told Okechukwu that my father hit his mother. Why would you do that? What do you intend to achieve in doing that? Look at this one. Though. Who cares what transpired between you and Oke? Do you think I notice your existence? No, you don't. It's very, very glaring you don't notice my existence. 
but you go about talking about me. Why would you do that? Am I the only girl in this village? Have you lost your sanity? You won't talk. Ogochi, just keep deceiving yourself. You hear me? Do you think Ogechuku will choose you over some other Polish guests out there? Wait until he meets one and see how he will throw you away like, like the garbage you are. Yes. I accept, Amarachi, I am a garbage. Yet he chose me amongst all the maidens in this village. That means I'm better than all of you. And let me warn you for the very last time. If you dare intrude in my affairs, I swear, the kind of slap I will give to you. You see this, your eardrum. Your eardrum, it will receive a lot. You will not do anything. I will not do what? Hey. 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 What are you doing? Papa? Are you supposed to be here? Papa? Papa? <laughs> What is going on? What is the update? What, what, what is the doctor saying? I, I don't know. I have not seen the doctor yet. In fact, I, I was just preparing to go to the hospital now. Do they say that uh, one of the nurses said that one of the eyes... The eyes... He called it one name like this. Is it retina? <laughs> retina, whatever. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not too sure what, what she did. The, because they are all the nurse are even talking about. The only thing is that the, the, I understood is that she, because they say that the one, of, the one of the eyes has to be replaced and somebody has to donate eye for it. And as, the, as I'm seeing everything now, whether the father or Gozier are prepared to donate their eyes to, 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 to replace my daughter's eye. I, I am an old man. My eyes cannot match her old. Oh, it is better to know that I'm an old man. Who told you? Have you seen the doctor? Did he talk to tell you? You go and donate your eyes first. Let the doctor say that it's not An old man's eyes cannot. It's not true. It's not true. Go and meet the doctor first. What are you talking about? Why well, you not the one that is portraying yourself as the one that loves my daughter? I love her. My daughter is a woman. Donate your eyes. You are a woman. She cannot be seen in the eyes of a man. I don't understand. I, 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 what about your son? Not your son. Your son. Run away. My son is a man. Hey! Woman, off your. Mother. Off your. It's now. Before I will say what to my daughter, both of you will say ten. You love, you love her most. Go and donate Let your eyes. Let her be seen with the eyes of a woman. You have to do. Go and donate your eyes. Go and see the doctor. See, so see. Donate they will remove all of your eyes and give my daughter. Mama, Uguchi is going blind. I don't know. I don't know what kind of devil is this one. Some stupid boys, they were playing with catapult. They fired her eyes with stone. They rushed her to the hospital and the doctor confirmed that her retinas are, are damaged. <laughs> That's terrible. <sighs> so what's the solution now? Uh, someone needs to uh, donate one eye for her, for her to be able to see again. <laughs> her parents will see to that now. That's the problem. You know, the doctor confirmed that her brother's own actually matches with her own. Mm, it's good now. But the boy refused to, 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 to donate. Mama, 
Rest, rest. I'm telling you that because that's what the doctor said. He said that I cannot be able to see. No, 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 no. I reject it. You see, everything will be fine. I know you, you, you'll be okay. Eh? Nothing, nothing will happen. So, 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 so talking like that. It must definitely be a way out. Just, just relax. There's no way out. You're telling me this because you don't want me to be a man. Just go ahead and live your life. Get married to another woman. I don't want to be a pest. Oh God, stop talking like that, please. You will be all right. Listen, instead of you to go blind, I am ready to give you one of my eyes. Yes, I'll give you. I'll give you. No, no, no. no, no. Can't do that. Listen, can't listen. Do that. I will do everything for you. I will do anything for you. Just trust me. You, you'll be fine. Eh? Just, just, just calm down. Just, just, just wait. Just... Doctor, doctor, please. I want you to run an operation right now. Eh? Take one of my eyes. Give it to her. I don't mind. Look, it's not a laughing matter. I am serious. It's not possible, young man. It's not possible. What do you mean it's not possible? I, I can't watch her go blind. She's my love. She means everything to me. I just, know. just take one of my and give it to her, please. I know, I know. But it's not possible. Possible. I. From the last test we carried out, there's a development here. There's a development. I don't understand. What are you trying to see? That that is possibility that she can see? Yes. Yes. Huh? Yes. Yes. From what I'm saying, yes. 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 It's possible. Hey. Okay. The doctor, the doctor. Hey, he said there, there, there is hope. You see, there's, there's hope. Listen, even if the, even if it doesn't work, I'll give you my eyes. Don't worry at all. Come, come down, eh? Come down. Yes, so How are you? I'm fine. How is your brother? My brother is fine. What of mama? <laughs> mama is fine. <laughs> what of uh, your brother's blind girlfriend? I'm a boy. Ah. And who told you she's blind? Everybody knows. Uh -uh. For your information, she has been discharged from the hospital today. And she can see perfectly. I can see you don't have any other thing to say. I came to look for you and I met my mind alone, so I decided to assist her. Oh, come yeah, that's very nice of you. I'm assisting me here just to make sure that there's enough food for me to eat. So, you actually feel these cans? Can yes. <laughs> you know, that was actually one of my plans. I was planning to do it. You know, I told you I have many plans. <laughs> I suspected you people were very tired when you come back, so I just decided to ease the stress of you. You're a good man, though. Yes. Thank you. Hey. You have just removed them of all the bodies of the people who are in his hands. They take care here because you have just removed one of his hands. That reminds me, Papa. I, I want to use this opportunity to say I'm sorry for what happened the other day. I, I didn't know that Gotri actually left her chores and came to my house. Please, forgive me. It won't happen again. 
Sorry, it was an oversight. Sorry. <laughs> One should always have priorities in life. Do you understand? Get them right. Do the right thing at the right time. That's true. You're right. Thank you, Papa, for your kind words. Um, I'll apply caution. <laughs> All right, um, everybody, I need to be on my way now. Yes, Obi, my mother is right. Stay and eat with us. I would have loved to, but I know they will be looking for me in the house. I didn't tell my mother I would stay. Yeah, it's a good one. You know they will be looking for him. Next time, I'll have it. Thank you. Well, let me see him up. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you, eh? Uh, don't hold her. Like, yeah. You're yeah. paid. Papa, okay. now! You're so paid. Please listen up. Did you finish the day? No, it's a bad work plans. It's one of your plans. You can go and do it. It's one of your plans. Go and continue now. Go and continue. Yeah. Please, please, please. You can have the or what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my love. Okay, at this point, I need you to go back. Listen, I know you are tired, hungry, and exhausted. You've tried. Just go back home. I am tired, but I still want to spend more time with you. Me too. But I'm seeing you later this evening. Is that a promise? Yes, and I won't fail. <laughs> Listen, I use your spot. I love that place. <laughs> Please do not disappoint me. I won't, baby. <laughs> I love you. I love you so. I love you too. Listen, you mean everything to me. You're the best gift that I have ever received in my life. Oh. Your happiness is my happiness. Thank you so much. Thank you for loving me the way you do. I love you so much. And tell me, nothing will ever come between us. Nothing. Okay. Nothing will come between us. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Take care of yourself. Mm -hmm. All right. Now go back home. Go back. <laughs> All right. We are breakable, but you love for God love you more. This love is beautiful. Oh God, I heard everything you said. I heard every bit of it. Every bit of it, I heard it. Yes. I am not hiding it. Yeah. That young man is not bad after all. I'm not hiding it. Listen, don't misunderstand me. I don't have anything against you. Okay. Okechuku is a fine young gentleman. Every sane man will want to have him as a son-in-law. But the worry that I have where he is is unemployment status that he has. If he has to marry my daughter, then he needs to first of all discover himself. Discover himself in a way that he will first of all leave this village. When he leaves the village, he will go to the city and look for the white collar job. So that he can be a responsible man and have enough money to take care of the wife he will marry himself. Ha! Who would want to have a useless boy as a son in law? I'm sure you will not like it. To feel what? Like it will never be a continuity in my home. Yeah. Ha! You want to go and I become a mother-in-law to somebody who is so jobless. To feel what? Ha! Okay, get your jobless. I don't make people, I don't matter for you. So I'm going to buy you, I'm going to buy you more of Papa, 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 you are right. You are right. See, my sister is beautiful. She's beautiful and she's educated. I spent a lot of money on Yes! Huh? You leave me and you went and Train, train her. Uh, no, no, she, 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 she need a, 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 a rich man so, so that she can change her, her, her family. Have one matter. Ha. Me chiyon oge. Akoyeli. What is wrong with you? Are you not a man? Is there anything wrong with your own hands? That you cannot go to the city, make enough money, bring it back home, and alleviate this family out of poverty it... and into a greater height, like you said. So. Okay, you are now encouraging our daughter to marry a poor man. Not into that. I know that's what it is. Now, please, you must hear my own side of the story. It's not that I am encouraging my daughter into anything, but I know that what I want for my daughter is good. Okay? I, want, I married to a poor man, yeah. and I am happy with you. I am happy, very happy with you. See, all that matters in this life is happiness. It is priceless. Okay? I, 
I, I trust Okichu. Okichu is a hard-working young man. I know with time, he will make it. He will turn everything around. Eh? But the kind of love he, speak, he shares with my daughter, the, the kind of love both of them have for each other, there's no height they will not attain. Let's give them a chance to, to succeed in what they are doing. Okay, we, we, we will succeed. The people will succeed. Mama, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Baba, I'm going to kill the queen. If if it's all about uh, uh, love and being happy, can you know my boy? He 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 rich like like other people. He 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 not from those. Huh? You know now. Why not you go elevate our uh, uh, this this poor poor family to 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 to, to the city? Huh? Oh, yeah, no. Nah, same, nah, 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 See, eh, can you If you're not planning, eh, when you're planning village, don't worry, we can fear now. If you're not planning. Do I know you from somewhere? Okay, my name is Lucy. Uh, okay, right? Okay, yes, that's my name. Uh uh. Okay! <laughs> I can't believe it. Lucy! <laughs> okay, how are you? <laughs> Lucy! I mean, what, are you, what are you doing here? I came to see my grandma. I mean, you're from this town? Mm -hmm. This is my village now? Uh uh. This is my village now. My grandma is just down there. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> this person I just met with you. You tell me. Hey, we're back. I think we need to talk. And it's very important. No, no, no. Let's go. What's this? Oh, no. Don't get inside, please. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, like I'm your mate before. Uh, Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! What do you mean? Eh? <laughs> anything about her but ma, that's because i never knew she's from this town i just met her a few hours ago mm. yes <laughs> never know. thank you mama it's true mama we were friends in school but we we're not that close but we are close now <laughs> <laughs> mama you raised a very very good boy <laughs> i am so flattered <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, mm. Please, can we go inside? Let me offer you something. Uh, Mama, no, no, no. She's um, actually rushing to somewhere very important. You know, she was supposed to just drop me and leave. But I said, no, since you are here, let's I just say hi to you people. Right. But I'm sure she will come next time. Mm -hmm. Of course. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're always welcome to my house. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you, Ma. Um, Mama, I have something for you. I forgot to buy bread, so. I want you people to manage this. Hmm? This is 50,000 hmm? Yes, mama. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Nke a karizire. All this. Yes, ma'am. For me. Yes, ma'am. Nem dal o. Thank you, Auntie Lucy. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. Give this one. If you're so cute. Thank you. Hey, hey, enough of uh, all that flattery right now. Let us talk about this bread. Hey, me too, I can eat bread. I like bread. <laughs> <laughs> this, one this one is for my man. Uh, hey, hey, do it for me. Oh, hey, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> come again. Oh, no. Mama, come again. She will come again. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey. You mean she's from the Obese's family? Uh -huh. That's mm -hmm. wealthy family. Yes. Yeah. I mean, if you look at her, you will know. Money is written all over her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> indeed. <laughs> My son, indeed. You could imagine how she just dished out 50,000 naira. Uh -huh. Just I like that. It's noisy. Eh? <laughs> I can't remember the last time I handled such an amount of money. <laughs> <laughs> hey! You think I mm -hmm. It's not worth it. My son. Yeah. And how did you meet such a girl? Yes, um, it was um, way back in school. Mm -hmm. I was in my first year and she was in a fine house, you know, and um, we became friends. We had something going on. But then again, I lost contact when uh, she was writing her final year exams. Mm -hmm. mm. But it's a small word. <laughs> hey, yes. she was quite a good girl though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And she was a really light. You don't need fast forward. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. My son. Yeah. This girl. She's really into you. Like she rightly said, she likes you. Mm -hmm. I hope you're not trying to compromise your affection. You have for Gucci. <laughs> Mama, you are, are you joking or what? Eh? No, all those things she was just doing is just. Um, Trying to display the good girl in her, and that's all. That's not it. Yeah? She's good, eh? But my good is, eh? <laughs> no, no, that's it. You know what I'm saying? No, but leave it like that. Leave it like that. Wait, yeah. with caution. Sure, sure, sure. Anyage, cha. Bia. Uh, 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 this uh, 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 short short engine. Paul! Don't make carry woman the conjoint. Huh? You, your mama knows say you come here. You see this money where you they, they get for your papa shop every day? I'm really sorry for what's happened in the past and I'm sorry I didn't appreciate your good gestures then. <laughs> you see, I really understood everything back then. I mean, you were in a relationship, you loved him so much, you guys were so into each other and, and what's that name again? Oh, Joe, Joe, yeah. <laughs> How is he? I don't want to talk about him, that's an old chapter that's been closed in my life. Oh really? Yes. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. And you? Do you have a girlfriend? Oh, yes, I do. Okay. Um, do you love her? Ah, that's an understatement. I love her so much. She means everything to me. <laughs> yes. Okay, you know, this is one thing I really liked about you in school. I mean, how many men would agree that they have a girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, we still have some good guys. I mean, people better than me that are there. But it's okay. <laughs> Say so. <laughs> so what are you doing about your, uh, your unemployment? Are you still on your search? Yes. The truth is I am tired. If I tell you the number of companies I have dropped my CV for the past two years, you will not believe me. It's, it's crazy. You know, even the ones I called my friends that I was hoping that it could help, but they all fail. I know. Friends fail, you know, especially people you trust. It's so unfortunate. You know my father has a lot of companies. I know. And guess what? I've been promoted to the MD of one of his textile companies. Ah, oh, that's good news. Mm -hmm. I'm happy for you. I know. So, I'm willing to give you a job. You can give me a job? Yes. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Ah, Lucy, that, 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 that would be the greatest news I've heard in recent time. Please, I really need this job. You don't know what will happen to me if you give me this job. Please, eh? I will appreciate it. Ha! Ah, God, thank you, thank you, thank you. Condition? What condition? I have seen a lot of things. Just name it. Say it. I am ready to do anything. That you end it with your lover and pledge your heart with me. See here. Yeah. I'll worry back it. Uh, have you seen uh, have you seen Okechuku since morning? Of course not. I told you I've been expecting him since yesterday. Why do you ask? Uh -huh. You see? Because he has been with another girl. Since yesterday night. That is why you have not seen him. Huh? What nonsense are you talking about? Eh? Shall we have started? You have started up here? Yeah? Okay, I don't understand. Why are you always classifying the fact you do not know about uh, Okechuku's nonsense? I'm telling you what is on ground. That's because and you're not making any sense. You're not making any points. How can you tell me that my own Okechuku is with another woman? What is wrong with you? I'm not making sense. You know that's impossible. It's impossible. So, how was my So, you don't believe your brother, B? I'm going to Okechuku is not a Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. And I say, no, 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 I'm talking nonsense. I'm telling you this because you're my sister. If you don't believe me, go and find out for yourself. Agosi, are you all right? Are you, are, you, are you balanced at all? Can you let me be? Okay, no problem. Do you know what you will do now? Go and find out yourself. Go and find out. If you want to go and find out, if you want to go and find out, go and find out now. I'm going to die. I'm going to Why I'm telling you this now? Because you're my brother. You're my sister. So that, okay, you go and deceive you. Open your eyes, oh. Hey, ma, Anata. Hey, ma, welcome. <laughs> My daughter, you're welcome. Thank you. Mama. No, no. Uh. <laughs> Mama, I brought your son back for you. I told you he'll be very safe. See him now, he's looking very good, right? Thank you very much. I knew you would bring him back safe and sound because you will take care of him very well for me. Hello. Then, now that you're here, let me cook for you. And this time, don't turn me down, fine. Mama, I will not. At least when I leave the village in two days, I will have something to remember. Your food. <laughs> yeah. Hey. I need to see my grandmother. Besides, I'm a very busy woman. <laughs> yes, ma. Hey. Uh, talking about work, I don't know if my son here briefed you about his unemployment situation. Mama, do not worry about that anymore. I will take care of it. I've already told him. He'll be working with um, me and one of my father's company. 
What? Yes. <laughs> Already, yes. yes. So. <laughs> oh, thank you, uh. Thank you so much. Um, You're welcome. Hi, Anna. Hope there's no problem. Um, Is there a problem? I'll be back. No, no problem. No, Are you okay? Right. It's alright, it's fine. Let's go inside. Oh. Hope it's fine. No, no problem. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> Yes, he's alright, he's alright. What about your brother? I mean, has he told you the reason why he hasn't come to the city to accept the job? I fear he might lose the job. Why? Because he told us the condition he attached to it. Okay, so that means um, he has made up his mind then? Not really, and to see, you see. To be honest with you, my brother loves Ugochi so much. They've come a very long way and they have their history together. They are so attached to each other, they are inseparable. And my brother, I know, can never compromise his affection for Ugochi. He does one girl at a time. Can you vouch for this Ugochi the way you're vouching for your brother? Yes, I can. We are women, we know what we do, you know, right? No, not to Gochi. My brother loves her so much, and I can confidently tell you she loves him more. But, Auntie Lucy, isn't it possible? I mean, can't you offer my brother the job without getting what you want from him? He needs the job more than anything. We need it. My family wants him to get a job so he can take care of us. I should be in school by now, but there's no money for that. Can't you at least do this for my mom and I? You're making this look like I, I don't want to give him the job because of this. No. I also have a history with him. We went to the same higher institution. When I was in my final year, he was a fresher then. And the first time we met, made a very wonderful impact. Yes, I had a relationship then and I treated him with disdain. And I am very sorry for that. I loved your brother. But I had a relationship then and that was all that mattered to me. No other man mattered to me, not even your brother. So what about him now? Honestly, I don't want to talk about that. We had a very, very painful experience together. I love your brother. Sincerely, I do. It's not about my money, it's not about my wealth, it's not about anything or my family name or anything, but I love your brother. I respect him so much. He's the kind of man I want to live my life with. Like. It's okay, Aunt Lucy. No. Come on. Lucy was here earlier. She said she came to check. I know whether you've made your decision. I have made my decision and I made it known to her already now. Nothing can change my mind. Eh? Since she's giving me that job with condition, I cannot leave the one I love. I told her already. Why is she coming here to ask again? My son. Lucy feels something very strong for you. I can see it in her eyes. She said it would be difficult for her to employ you. And set her eyes on you every day when you are not her man. That does not make her a bad girl. That doesn't make her selfish. She's been... A woman. Only a woman. Okay. So, Mama, what are you implying? I mean, what are you trying to say? That I should leave the one I love for her because of the job? Is no. that what you're saying? No, my son. No. That is not what I'm saying. All I'm saying is I stand by you. Uh -huh. Your decision is my decision. Mom. 
All I want is your happiness. Baba, that happiness is with Ogochi. And nothing would jeopardize it. Trust me. Hmm? Then it's settled. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh? It's alright, Baba. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll be leaving for the city in a few days. I want to know your decision, like, what do you think? I want the job, yes. But the truth is, I cannot leave Ugochi for anything. Ugochi is a part of me now, and I don't have a life without her, and I mean it. Okay, that's a decision then. See, I don't know why you don't want to give me this job. I really need this job. But the truth is, I, I, cannot, I cannot do that to Ugochi. We have come a long way. She means everything to me, and we love ourselves so much. We, we have good history together. Please, try and understand. Mm -hmm. I do. Okay. It's just so painful you just cannot see through my heart. And it's more painful that you don't know I truly love you. At some point in my life, I just couldn't do anything without you. I had to go to the social media to search for you. That wasn't funny. Okay, don't take it like I'm um, maybe using this as leverage into luring you to love me. That's not true. I just can't stand you as in seeing you loving another woman. It's not possible. Okay. When I get back to the city, I'll ask any of my father's friends. If they have any vacancy, I'll get back to you. Promise? Thank you, thank you so much. I'll appreciate it. I love you for your honesty. And um, please remain faithful to your woman and take good care of her. Thank you. Even come close to me. Don't. Go. I am sorry. But trust me, she 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 has left the village for good. She she has gone. Listen, I, I think you misunderstood me. I don't have anything with her. Why am, am I stupid? Why will I leave you for? I mean, it, it's it's not normal. I can't leave you for anybody. Listen, I, I really love you. Uh, please, just try and understand me, please. You know why I did that? No. Because that is what you were expected to do when she kissed you. <laughs> <sighs> My love, I'm so sorry for not trusting you. I was just being oversensitive. You know I love you so much. Please, you have to promise me. You will never accept any job offer from her. Your own job will come and you will have it. God will do it for us, okay? Alright. I promise you. Let her just go with her troubles. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Trust you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're fine now, right? Yeah, we're fine. <laughs> <laughs> I got you, Fuller. Yes. Wait! Wait! <laughs> the big masquerade has visited me. <laughs> Uwaka, I hope I am safe. Of course you are safe. <laughs> but what do you expect? I have been waiting to hear from you for a very long time now. Well, since Mohammed has refused to go to the mountains, it has to be the other way around. That is why I'm here. Uh, Dikora, uh, I'm sorry about that. But uh, you didn't hear from me because I've been working on that. Uh, for how long it should, Doka? See, whatever you are doing, you have to speed it up. Because I don't have all the time. I've said I'm sorry. Anyway, I have made the inquiries. And um, the... Eh, uh, uh, one... Uh, so, 
Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Who is that beautiful man? Uh, well, uh, <laughs> that's uh, Ugochi, my daughter. You don't say. You mean that beautiful girl is your daughter? Uh, yes. That's your little girl that I used to know? <laughs> it's the same girl, no? You know, children of nowadays, they grow very, very fast. Uh, in Igbo, we say, okay, Basia, oh. when a man has finished growing, he will wait for the other ones to also grow up to his level. She's very beautiful. <laughs> I know, she takes after her father. <laughs> anyway, um, as I was saying, um, uh, it's your doka. To be honest with you, since I lost my wife, I had resolved never to get married again, despite the fact that I have no child. For the day I set my eyes on your daughter, all that changed, yes. I mean, no woman, not even my late wife, has made me feel that way. Yes, Ijodoka, I think I I like your daughter to the extent of marrying her. And I cannot hide it. That is why I have come to officially make it known to you. Uh, um, Dikora. Yes? I have not said that what you said is not good. But are we talking about Ugochi, my daughter? Because that is my daughter that you saw. It's your daughter I am talking about. Why are you trying to sound as though it is something impossible? Or no, wouldn't you want me to marry your daughter? No, it's not that. It's because it is the least thing that I ever expected from you. Uh, uh, anyway, uh, who will not want to have somebody like you as a son-in-law? Why not? But you know that uh, it is not my decision to make. It is the girl in question that has to decide whether she can marry you or not. It's your daughter. She is your daughter. You can always influence a decision. You can always do that. Just imagine what it would mean you having me as your own son-in-law. I, I don't want to exaggerate what I can do. I can turn the fortunes of your family. Make your daughter understand this. I like her. I want her to be my wife. Papa, <laughs> are you serious? No, 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 don't, don't tell me. Don't tell me you're joking. How can I joke about such a thing? Am I a child? Listen, Ubaka treats young man with this our community. The Omilor. I feel like Papa, I want it. to beg at the No, no, no. Come back. Don't, don't break it. Don't come down the house. Calm down. I told you. Wait Papa. until at least after they included all the marriage rights uh, and the money is then you can pull it down because I am sure that Oko will chew you. Huh? Will hey! 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 I told you! I told you that I have plans! Even when I say I have plans, you don't know my plans! Do you know how many times I've been praying and fasting about this thing? I said, God! God, where are you? Come on, answer our prayers! Come on, answer our prayers! May I see it? God, answer our prayers, Papa! Hey! You're not going to go! Hey! Papa! Hey! You see? Are you drinking Panadol for another person's right? Are you the one they want to marry? Even when they bring the money, is it your pocket to go? I'm the one who will collect the bride price. Anyway, you are not alone in this. Everybody is happy. I promise you are still alive. I promise you are still alive. Hey! But you need to die. Hey! Papa! Hey! Papa! Hey, what's Papa? There's a problem. Hey, Ugochi, 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 Ugochi is the problem. But she has left. That boy, that boy that calls himself, uh, uh, that calls himself lover boy. That boy, that boy has eaten Ugochi's heart. 
Is, if it's that what you are talking, then that's not a problem. That's why they are no longer together. The boy has gone to find another woman. But who told you? They are together. They are still together. I don't know how it happened. But what I know is that they are together. They have reconciled. Do you know that now? The love they have now. Their love is even more stronger than before. I, I, I don't know. Mama, the boy, you But listen, anyway, I, I know that to go to you will not be stupid enough to reject such a beautiful proposal from somebody like Oba. Baba, <laughs> 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 if you talk to if she does that, eh, <laughs> she will have me to contend with you. Mama, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Because come back. Ah, leave me alone. I said, come back here. I'm not done talking to you. What's wrong with you? If you try walking out on me again, I will kill you with my bare hands. Baba, you will not kill me. Oh, I will kill you because you are being very stupid. Man, you are taking this too far for my liking. Why are you shouting at my daughter? I will do even worse than that. Why is she being so unreasonable? Uh -uh. Why will you refuse a marriage proposal for someone like Obaka? Baba, I will refuse whomever I want to refuse. You don't have right to choose my husband for me. It's my life. I have the right to live it the way I want. Eh? Okay. Okay. Mama, leave me up. Mama, leave me. Okay. Leave me. Has it got to that? Eh? It has gotten more than that. Talk to your daughter, woman. Talk to your daughter. Let her come back to her senses. If not, she will die by my hands. It has gotten to that. It has gotten to that. It has gotten to that. Look at my You know who by force. She doesn't want him. She doesn't want him. I have not seen a man insisting that her daughter will get married to a man she doesn't like. What kind of nonsense is this? Look up in the market. Dikora, what can I offer you? Well, I don't think I want anything. I just come to know the outcome of your discussion with your daughter. I want to know if she has finally accepted my proposal. Um, um, Dikora. I think she will need more time to reflect on that. She barely knows Papa, you. Why don't you tell him what I have said? You get out of here. Who called you here? Where men are discussed. I am the topic of this discussion for crying out loud, Papa. Fine. Let me make my point very clear to you since my father has decided to mince words. I am not interested in your proposal and I will never be. Please. Kindly find someone else. Can we try and be more civil here? Excuse me? Civil, you said? Are you being civil? Proposing to a maiden behind her. Why go through my father? Or probably because you think you have so much money, you can get anything you want. Right? I am sorry if you misconstrue my good intent. I did that to drive home my good intentions. <laughs> The reason I did not come directly to you is because I don't want your parents to think I am here to flirt with you. Exactly. The truth is I want you to be my wife. And I am very sorry if you find my method offensive. Hmm. Seriously, no harm is meant. Well said. But please, please, please. My heart has been bought by another. I am not interested in your proposal. Leave my father's house with your ill-gotten wealth. I'm not interested. Get out! Because you're nothing, you're a big girl. You cannot talk to my friends. Right now. Eh? How could you? How could you lay your hands on my daughter because of her back? Oh my god, you Your daughter is lucky. I only made an attempt and she ran away. Next time. I will strangle her with my bare hands for displaying that kind of rubbish she did inside there. You will not do such thing now. Eh? You cannot lay your hands on, on, on her because of Obaka. Ugochi is not interested in his proposal. Case closed. You should not kill my daughter for me because of uh, 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 Obaka. She doesn't want him. She's not interested. You should leave my daughter alone. Because don't kill her for me. Wait, 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 Papa. Papa, wait. wait. It's not even bitter. You only made an attempt oh. and she ran away. Eh? And she's still outside by this time. Why didn't you send me to go and look for her? Do you know that when I look at you, I don't even know what to tell you. You can't even shut up for once when you don't have many really meaningful things to say. There's no time you have ever had anything reasonable to 
con to contribute in a in a discussion. You don't know my plan. Shut your mouth up. Shut up. Because you don't my know my plan. My father, my son. M Mama, because you don't know my plans. I don't tell you my plans. What I know is that she ran away and she's hiding somewhere. But I know that that place she's hiding cannot save her. <laughs> it will not save her. But just permit me. Say, say, my son, my only son, go. <laughs> my only son. That's why you don't want to be useful to yourself. My only son, go. You don't have work to do. Nothing to do at all as a man. This is not about him. What I'm saying is that if she tries that nonsense, she tried again. I will strangle her. Leave my daughter alone. Leave if, if you know that this house will contain both of us. Don't just lay your filter hands on her. Because if you do, you will not get a good of a trouser. You will not care because she refused to marry Obaka. But she married the man she doesn't want her to she doesn't want to get married to. Because you want her. No, you won't kill her. Go and make food. Papa, can you imagine? Mama want me to tell her my plans. Okay, hey, why would I tell my plans? Hey, hey, oh, don't put it down. Why can't I tell her my plans now? Don't worry. Sorry, George. Every time you have plans, you but you never execute. It's that plan. Get, get, get out. You return to your house after eating your food. Oh, she will bring food for you. By then, your father's anger would have subsided. Mama. I'm not going back to that house this night too. You don't know my father. He has completely lost it. Ugo, you will. If not, you'll worsen his anger. Eh? Okay, don't worry. I will take you myself. Oh, Mama, you won't understand. My father is a very stubborn man. He won't listen. Hello? Huh? <laughs> That's good. Uh -huh. You! So this is where you are? Oh! Aren't you lucky? They are even serving you food. <laughs> Get up here and run home. I said run home! I'm not going anywhere with you. Leave me alone. You're not going? Mm. Masudoka, just calm down. I have something to tell you. Hey, hold it there, woman. I am the one who has something to tell you. If you love your son, tell him to leave my daughter alone. My daughter is already engaged to be married. If he makes the mistake of breaking her engagement, I will kill him. I will kill him. Tell him that. And that's for you. If you love yourself and you love that boy, keep yourself away from him. Keep yourself away from him because I'm going to kill him. Now, get up and go. Get up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Please just tell me it's not true. Listen, just tell me it's not true. Tell me they are not trying to link you up with another man to get married to. Huh? No, please just tell me That's now. It's not possible. You know I'm yours forever. Yeah, I know. But, but, but is it true that Ubaka came here and asked for your hand in marriage and your father is uh, persuading you to get married to him? Yes. Hey. But you know, nobody can force me to marry anyone against my will. Hey. I cannot be forced into any marriage. I am not a domestic animal. I know, but I am scared. Uh, eh? mm -hmm. You don't have to be scared. I love you and I'm yours forever. I know. But it's just that, you know. You don't have to complain. Hey, 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 hey. Come. Come, what are you doing here? Ugochi, mm -hmm. you don't tell her say now, no back against you now. I don't what's wrong with you. Don't mind me. Tell her, Mom. No. Tell her. Do you know, see, 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 see. I cannot pursue you come here now because you don't know my plans. Why I don't pursue you now because you don't know my plans. There they go. Tell her, say you, you belong to Ubaka. I go say, respect yourself. Respect tell her, Mom. You're embarrassing my guests. See, if Ubaka come here, eh? Do you know Ubaka? The richest man in this village. Better they don't know if Ubaka come here. <laughs> see, eh? Oh, why can't I kill you? Oh, why can't I kill you? Can you imagine? So you see your mind come here. Cause there, the other day, tell me it's not true. Tell me it's not true. Your mind is there, they say, 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 they
former. Are you that daft? You really just came back from the city and you go such a news to him. What do you expect? Then Mama, he asked me. Did he ask you for the things? Eh? And we found you, okay? All you should have said is the girl is fine. Now we don't even know where he has gone to. Mama is back. Mama, I need to pay Ukochi's bride price immediately. What? Okay, what are you talking about? Mama, you know what I am talking about. What I am telling you is what I need to do right now. Mama, I am about to lose the one I love to somebody else. Because somebody that is not in the same class with me at all. The only solution is to go and pay for a dowry right now. Okay, Chuku. Did you secure the job you went to the city to look for? No. But, but, but what does that have to do with what I am telling you now? It has to do with it a whole lot. Huh. Okay, Chuku. You don't have money. You don't have job. And you want to start up a family. Is that what you want for your life? Try it. Try it. If we. Papa, this is not fair. I am about to lose this girl that I love. Eh? What do you want me to do? I'm losing the one I love. Oh. Forget you, man. Don't leave me. I love you, my baby. Don't you leave me? Oh, come on. Don't you leave me? Uh -huh. Uh -huh, I yeah. can't do come. without you. Don't you leave me? Oh. Uh, my daughter, welcome. Eh? Thank you, Papa. Uh, well done. Um, I was made to understand that you insulted Mazi Obaka two nights ago. Papa, I did not insult him. Brother, he was the one that insulted me. Because he called my Okechuku names. He said he's cursed. And I don't like that. So you are not happy that the man said the simple truth? The truth? Papa, please. What truth are you talking about? It is obvious to me that uh, you don't know anything about this young man that you said you like. And you are not even prepared to ask questions. Huh? Listen, for your information, that family, in fact, their entire lineage is cursed. Papa! This thing happened a long time ago. Old time ago. His great, 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 great grandfather killed his wife. We don't know whether it was for rituals or for sacrifice to the gods. We don't know. But I, what we know is that when the woman was dying, she laid a curse on him and his generations. And that is what is affecting their family. That's why their family is backward today. Or have you seen anybody progressing from that family? Papa. Eh? Papa. Please stop making up stories simply because you do not like him. Stop! You feel I am making up stories? Mm. Okay. Go out there and ask any elder in the village. Ask anyone. I'm not going to intervene. This is a sing song in the village. Everybody knows that the family is cursed. That's why they're backward. You don't want to get yourself into that. Mama, mama, please. Mama, please. I don't want to hear that no more. I don't want to hear that. Uh. When one finger touches palm oil, it will rub on all that fingers. A word is enough for the wise. Yes. Please, Agosie. Tell me everything you know about those people. I, I don't know anything about that family. But my friend Izuna says something. My friend Izuna said that uh, uh, they have this history of their women dying before the age of 55. Goodness. My goodness. In other words, what they've always said about them is true. There is indeed a cause upon that family. Eh? I, I don't know. I don't know. But if father said that, that means it's true. But that means it's true. You know these elderly, elderly men, they have their ways into histories. Uh, I know my father. I know my father cannot lie. He cannot just 
cook up something just to spoil somebody's family. Hmm. Hey, wait, oh. Come to think of it. Why? Why Okechuku, okay, whom you said that graduated with first class upper, unemployed? <laughs> See, uh, uh, you know me now, eh? as, as though, uh, um, from my own understanding, anybody that graduated with first class upper, don't look for work. Rather, work just after them. Don't you think something is wrong in that family? I'm, I, I, I'm telling you this because, because I don't want my only sister to, 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 to make a mistake. Please, you have to be very careful. You have to be very careful with the kind of family you enter. Because I, I, I don't... I've said my own, no. I've said my own. Oh, I want to go and did she go there and not choke You better make a choice. Because I talk on easy going. If you're easy going to poverty, you're going to pop, pop, pop. Okay, I'm going to go I'm coming. Let me bring something. Obi. Obi, here's the water. Why is your face like this? I am not happy. What is wrong? What is going on with me? I don't understand. Ugom, all my mates that I graduated with, they are all doing well. I am talking about my mates that graduated with 2-2. They work in big, big companies. When you talk of me, a first degree holder in business administration, I cannot even secure a job for myself. Okay. Eh? I don't know what is going on. As I speak to you now, all my friends, they have all deserted me. It's like there is this heavy curse. Eh? Yes. Placed upon my head somewhere. No. Don't talk like that, my dear. I don't know what I am talking about. Sometimes I just I just feel like th there's a curse upon my head somewhere. It feels like a strong force, something greater than me that is working against me. I don't know how to explain this curse. Fine, it's like a generational curse. Uh -uh. Yes. Obim, huh. do not talk like that. Don't tell me you believe in all these fetish things about curses. You don't have any curse following you. That your time hasn't come doesn't mean that you are cursed. What about me? Will you say that I'm cursed because I do not have a job yet? Come, your case is different. At least you got a job and you turned it down because the money wasn't good enough for you. Hey. Let them give me a job and let me turn it down and see if I will turn it down because of the money. Eh? I know what I am saying. Do you know how many companies I have been to? Carrying CV every day of my life. Something is wrong. I understand. But at this point, you have to calm down. I... You have to calm down and be prayerful. I believe God is preparing something very good for you. You need to be patient. That's all I have to tell you, please. Come out of this mood. It doesn't suit you. This love is beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. We are unbreakable. But you love for God love you more. This love is beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. We are unbreakable. But you love for God love you more. This love is wonderful. Oh, oh, oh. No, wait, you just wait, wait, we just wait. What, what, what's the problem? Eh? Why are you deliberately avoiding me? If you see me from here, you take care. If you see me from here, you take care. Why? why, why? What, eh? are, what are you talking about? What's the meaning of that? Please stop, stop giving me such attitude. What's the meaning of all this rubbish? Oh, is it because of Ubaka? Because I've heard everything. No, I'm asking you now. Why are you, why are you quiet all of a sudden? You want to leave me because of Ubaka? You're forgotten everything we shared together. Eh? Why would you even leave me? After all, I'm a poor guy. I don't even have money. Yes, I can't take care of you. You're leaving me for a man you barely know because he has money. Tell me now, talk to me. You have forgotten everything we shared, Abi. Everything I, I, I sacrificed for you because of Ubaka. I don't have money. That's why, you, that's why you're treating me like that. Let me, let me just tell you, I, I, I'm very disappointed in you. As a matter of fact, you're a loose girl. Oh, Kechuku, you're very, very stupid. Why are you behaving childish and reckless? Did I tell you I have accepted him? That means you don't even know me too well. 
And how dare you? How dare you call me a loose girl? What they have always said about you is true. And in truth, you have a heavy cause upon your life. And meeting you is the worst thing that has ever happened to me. Excuse me. Ugochi. What did you just say? I am cursed. Did I hear right? Ugochi. Ugochi, what is it? Why are you doing this to yourself? Eh? What is the matter? Talk to me. Wait, which Okechuku are you talking about? The same Okechuku? Or another one? Same. <sighs> <clears throat> it's okay, my daughter. Listen, we all make mistakes. That's why we're human beings. Huh? What makes a real man is... When he makes a mistake, he realizes it and then makes a move to rectify it. Oh. Mistakes are bound to be made. But rectifying it is the issue. It's not too late for you to rectify the mistake you have made. And move forward. Okay? Papa, I am ready to accept Mazubaka's proposal. It's okay. You have made the right decision now. And you will see the way God is going to propel you and bless you. And give you happiness and joy everlasting. Thank you, Baba. Ifoma! Ifoma! Who is this guy? You are here. Sorry. Have you heard? Amara, please say what you want to say. I don't have. Ifoma, one. have you heard? Oh, so you've not heard that Ugochi has accepted to marry Ubaka? Mm. Which Ugochi? Your own Ugochi. Your very Ugochi. What nonsense are you talking about? You and I know that's not possible. Oh, so you don't believe me? Follow me and come and see things for yourself. What's going on? Eh. Uh -huh. <laughs> what, what, what are you talking about? <laughs> huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank God you are here. You know I like to say my own openly. I hate gossip. <laughs> Ugochi, your lover, has accepted to marry Ubaka. Are you talking to me? What kind of rubbish is coming out for me? What did you just say? Oh, Does it make sense? Same really? question oh, I asked. You don't believe me also? Why don't you go towards a former market road? They are along the road. Inside Ubaka's car. Guess what they are doing? They are kissing and romancing. Eh, mm, kissing and romancing. Go and see for yourself. You don't believe me. Kissing. Mm, kissing now. Nah. Don't you know kissing again? Your mouth. They are finished it. Honestly, you don't know how happy I am. In fact, you just give life to my soul. <laughs> I was a walking corpse until this your news that came to give me life. Honestly, I thought I was going to die if you had turned me down. Hey, please. Why would you die? So making me feel so special. <laughs> no, I, I am serious. I see. This was what I was trying to explain to you all this while. I have this deep affection for you. I don't even know how to explain it. That was why. What's going on? What is that? What's going on? What is this? Go, 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 go. Come, come here. What's, what's the meaning of this? My sister. I need you. What is the meaning of this? What are you? What are you doing? I'm taking you out of my house. Don't talk to me again. Young man, what is the problem? Okay. Uh, if you ask my problem, I will give it to you, give you away. But right now, I don't have your time. Just go back and spread inside your car. I am talking to my woman. Please. Hey, me! Who is your woman? Whatever we have is history. I'm not your woman. Did you? What's wrong with you? Did you hear her? Now, look back. What's wrong with you? 
I she may have been his girlfriend, but she's my wife officially now. Yes. What do you mean? Uh, are you not my wife? I am your wife. You, you can confirm it. Uh, shut up. Now listen. I will give you 50,000 naira. Bundle this idiot out 50, of here. 50,000 naira. Uh, what? Take this man out of here. Take him out of here. Out of here. So Take him out of here. Now let me go and get the money. You mean that hopeless boy attacked you? Of course he did. Chiodoka, that is the more reason I need to pay a dowry. Without further delay, I'll take her out of this village. In fact, you are right. Yes. Because that boy is a mad dog. And he can't do anything. In fact, he wants to destroy her life. In fact, that boy is a failure. Honestly, it would have been worse if not for the two young men that appeared from nowhere to, to salvage the situation. Hmm. And that reminds me, I, I think I need to see those young men. Where can I find them? Uh, uh, which boys are you talking about? Dubim and Ikena. Uh, huh? uh, listen, I may not know their names. Not only do I want them here, I want those boys to protect you from that rascal. So that they will never come close to wherever you are again. Huh? That means you have plans like me. <laughs> that means you, you, when you have the same blood, <laughs> you have plans. Go and look for the boys, he said. It's <laughs> not ordinary. Huh? Something is definitely wrong. No. Brother, please take it easy on yourself. Don't tell me to take it easy. Can't you see that they've, they've, they've bewitched my love? But one thing I know is that they will not succeed. They will never succeed. What am I even doing here? Huh? Brother. They won't succeed. Brother, please come back. Oh, give me. Mama, don't let him leave. Where are you going? Huh? Mama, don't worry. Just, you just, can't wait. Mama, don't worry. Just allow me. Hey! Okay, Chuku! Or back or whatever you are called. Let me just use this opportunity to warn you. Stay away from my girl. I know you have money, but you should have better things to do with your money. Go and help the less privileged. Go and help the motherless, motherless people. Don't use your, your, your money to call my woman. I am warning you for the last time. Young man, what is your name? I don't need to tell you my name. What are you using my name for? Uh, of course you are right. I don't need to know the name of a nobody like you. But I have one advice for you. Real men don't fight over women. They fight to make money like their mates. And I advise you concentrate on your low life than to fight and keep a woman that you cannot feed. Let me ask you, assuming you get married to that girl, how are you going to feed her with this your wretched life? How dare you? Don't. Open. Oh, oh, you shut up! I will rather drop you dead than drop the gun. Shut up! How dare you? So you have the effort free to come and attack me? You? No, no, now what if I kill you no, right now? Don't kill me. I, I, you, you think the police will question me? For your information, this gun is like sex. Hey. I'll kill you now, this minute. See, see, I was just going on my own when I saw you. I said, let me just explain to you and beg you as man to man. Oh, no, no, shut up and get out. Get out. Get out. I'm going. 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 I'm going.
about what I heard or what I was told. It's about what I have experienced, Mama. Okichuwa and I are not meant to be together. Yes. I'm sorry I realized that very late, but I don't ever want to have anything to do with Okichuwa. And I believe deep inside my heart that I'm making the right choice for myself. Huh? Please, Mama. Please. My daughter. What exactly are you talking about? That you have made up your mind to marry who? Papa, are you sure you are okay? I'm all right. You're I right. know you're going to talk about Okechuku, but please, I beg you, do not bring him into this. Okechuku is a mistake. What? Uh, hey, that Okechuku is what? A mistake? Go and join me that Okechuku is a mistake. Ha, ah, my daughter. What have you heard? What did they tell you? Mama, it's not about what I heard or what I was told. But it's about what I have realized. Okechuku is not the right man for me. We're not meant to be together. I'm just realizing that now. I'm sorry if I disappointed you with my decision, but that's fine now. I don't want to have anything to do with Okechuku again. And I believe deep inside my heart that I'm making the right choice for myself. Your father. Talk to your father now. Huh? What is it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you imagine? Come. Right there. Ugochi. Ugochi. You have completely lost it, Ugochi. Eh? How could you send some boys to go and beat up Ugochi? Oh my god, Jenny. Mama, I didn't send them. It was Mazi Ubaka that gave them the instruction. I tried as much as possible to stop them, but they wouldn't listen to me. All the same, okay, Chuku called for it. That anyway? Yes, because I warned him. You said what? That okay, Chuku called for what? Yes, he invited it. Hey! Uchi, you surprised me. You sure you are surprising me? It has not been long. It has not been long that that young man almost lost an eye for you. That was when nobody was there for you. Even this your brother could not sacrifice one of his eyes for you. Huh? Make sure never. Young one. See, if even if your feelings for him was not genuine, all you could do was just show him some appreciation. Because he has done a lot for you. Mm -hmm. And he is still doing it. Can you stop that? Mm -hmm. What appreciation? For what? What is it that he has done that cannot be? Huh? Please, my daughter, hmm? go inside and have some rest. Is that it? You're disturbing me. Leave them. Is that all you have to say? I don't have to say. No, I just sacrificed my eyes. Sure. One of my eyes sacrificed. You don't know my parents in this village, Joe. Who got you? Who got you? Come out here. Come so you got even great. Who got you? Who got you? Who got you? Come out here and face me. Ugochi, tell me it is not true. Tell me what I heard is not true. Tell me to my face that 
those men did not put my son in that condition because of you. Mama, Okechuku okay, called for it. What? He did. Eh? Uh, Okechuku okay, did what? Ugochi, is this you? My daughter, you have changed tremendously. So you are this unpredictable. So the love you were professing for my son all these years, they were not genuine. The feelings were not genuine. You were toying with my son's heart all these years. Gucci, how could you? How could you? Mama, I have not done anything to your son. I am not the one to be blamed here. You should blame your son. As a matter of fact, he deceived me. He deceived me so much. As a matter of fact, he made me believe he's what he's not. Thank God everything has been exposed. Please. Gucci, I can swear with my life here and now that my son did not do anything wrong to you. Mm. Your lofty eye is a problem. You saw a wealthy man and you hurriedly followed him, forgetting everything my son did for you. Okay, you will sacrifice everything for you. Uh, enough of that, woman. Almost gave his life enough. for you. What is it that he has sacrificed? That my wealthy son-in-law cannot prevail. And your so son. This is, <laughs> so this is a family plot. Even. Even you, okay. Um. I'm happy to this. Thank you. I, I'm not part of this. I will uh, never uh, be uh, part of uh, anything uh, that will hurt you. Because he has done a lot. That I know. I can never be part of this criminal act from my family. Mama. Wicked act. I'm going inside. I'm not going to be. Good boy. Be quiet and go inside. You forget people have forgotten so soon. You don't know my plans, so. though. Go inside because you have forgotten so soon. Am I going inside? No, I'm the one spearheading everything. You are. And it is good for my daughter. It will not be good for you. Mama, go inside, babe. Go inside. 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 Go if I don't want my eyes, I'll, I'll, my plans, I'll scatter my plans. You donate your plans so that your eyes can see. My son, I could not believe what happened today. I had the greatest shock of my life. The good you could have the goodness to tell me those things she said to me. Dear Mama, she's not who we think she is. That's what we are. That girl is unbelievable. And that is what I want your brother here to understand. That she is not the right woman for you. I totally disagree with you. I understand how what you are saying. Ugochi is just angry with me because of the hurtful things I said to her, and that's all. Brother, that this is far from that. Ugochi left you because you don't have money. Hey, keep quiet. What do you know about love? I don't talk to you. You're talking. This is where in love with each other. Sometimes arguments are normal. We just have little misunderstanding. I already concluded. She's my love. Leave it like that. It's just the, because of the argument. All I, I, I'm trying to do now is just to make sure everything is fine, and she'll forgive me. Uh, love one thing. Ugochi is not the right woman for you. Get it into your head. Ugochi is a scam. Hey, Mama, please. Brother, mm -hmm. listen to Mama. You keep quiet, you. Mama, please. I will not appreciate it if you need to speak ill of Ugochi. It's not, it's not fair because of one small little argument. Leave her like that. We will sort ourselves out, please. I love her and she loves me. <laughs> no, now, Chief. <laughs> Stop making me laugh, please. <laughs> I was going to say that now. Are you? Please, I will call you back. Oh, no, I'll call you back very soon. I need to do something for my mother. Yes, thank you. What are you doing here? Please, I beg you in the name of God. Try and understand. I love you so much. Listen, if I have done anything to offend you, just find a place in your heart and forgive me. Mm -hmm. You mean everything to me. You're my world. Understand what? You love me. You can't live without me. But you insulted me. If you truly love me like you said, you wouldn't have said those hurtful words to me. You don't love me. Just leave me alone. No, no, no. This is I was angry. Okay, fine. I admit I overreacted. Yes. Well, it doesn't change anything. Hmm? Yes. It doesn't change anything. Maybe to you it doesn't, but to me it has changed a lot. 
I believe what happened was a revelation. Yes, we're not meant to be together. We are incompatible. Please! I have found the right man for myself. And I'm getting married to him soon. So just leave me alone. Listen, when you're able to see me, that's even hurting me in my body. What would you see your family? Why, why, why? You want to throw everything you have shared? Remember all the sacrifices you have made? What, eh? mean to, you what sacrifice? Is it my school fees that you paid? Or the small, small chunk of money you used to give to me? Mm. You want it back? I will give it to you. Don't even try to remind me what you did for me, but what I did for you was more. No, no, no. That, that, that's not what I'm saying. Why would I talk about money? Ha. Listen, money cannot even replace the kind of love I have for you in my heart. Have you? I am not talking about money. Have you? Listen, give me a chance, please. Just try and understand. I will make it. I don't want. I'm sorry, people. I'll get rid of my cats. What's all this money? Somebody can't take this thing. What are you doing in this compound? Have I not warned you never to step into this compound again? Oh, you are trying my patience. It's alright. Wait for me. It's no matter of waiting for you, Papa. I can wait for you for that tomorrow. I, I listen, to die here. listen, you, you better go because my father, if he descends on you, I, I will ready. not be responsible if anything happens to I you. I'm ready to die. You must forgive me. Just assure me. Okay, uh, okay, 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 and I said I do not want a guy. Ugochi. 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 What are you? Uh, you are here. I'm looking for you. Come on, give me food. I'm hungry. Ugochi. What is wrong with you? Please, Agosi. Am I doing the right thing? I mean, am I making the right choice? Because I wouldn't want to do something I would end up regretting for the rest of my life. Hey, uh, what are you talking about? You know everything. Everything is happening so fast and I'm not given the opportunity to even think straight. I go here. you know I love Okichuko. It's undeniable. But the way I suddenly developed this hatred for him and accepted to marry Mazio Baka, is what I'm unable to explain. And I'm being convinced to accept it. I'm confused. You're my beloved brother. And I know you love me so much and you can never mislead me. That is why I've come to you. Please. In truth. Am I following the wrong path? Uh, uh, good job. Ugochi, I am glad you acknowledge the fact that I can never mislead you. If you are making the wrong choice, I will be the first to tell you. You know I love you, and I will always want the best for you. And this is the best for you. Ending up in a cursed family is the worst thing that can ever happen to you. Now you are getting married to a, a worthy man who loves you more and more. Ugochi, I am giving you 100% assurance that you will be happy with him. Okay, Chupu is not an option. Forget about him. Please. But, and also, you, you know he will also help me. You know. Ekene Kwangi, Ozo, Ichia, Udoka. Our son, Obaka, who may ask us to accompany him to your place so that he can formally pluck an apple he sighted in your place, which he cannot take his eyes off. So that is why we are here.
because I cannot decide on yes, my own what will happen. Yeah. Be perfect, then. That's it. That's it. <laughs> All right. So I will call the person involved. Uh, Ugo, dear. No. Uh, call your daughter. The busy Ruka, come. Call your daughter. When you did your be patient, <laughs> you know she's a beautiful girl before she comes out. <laughs> uh, no, 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 my daughter, on my little you in there. <laughs> um, Ubaka has come with his people uh, they, to ask for your hand in marriage, and they brought all these things. You are seeing, and much more. Uh, it is for you to tell us whether to accept or not. <laughs> ah! Come What happened? Where mama, is she? What happened? Where is your mother? Ah, Mama. Good afternoon, Mama. Eh, okay, your son has been arrested, though. What? He's turned down uh, Ugochi's marriage introduction. I'm back. I got him arrested by the police. Chimo. 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 Say, let me come. Nay. I came in respect of my son that was arrested by your son in law, Ubaka. Biko. So, what has that got to do with me? My everything. He's your son-in-law. You are closer to him. Biko, help me plead with him to release my son that he arrested. I went to his place, but he wouldn't listen to me. How would he listen to you? Were well, you not told what your son did? Nay, I was told. In fact, I was not even at home when he left. If not, I would have stopped him. Yes, I'm kaya. Biko, I promise he will never go near Ugochi and Ubaka again. If he releases him, I will never allow him to go near Ugochi or Ubaka again. And if that is the case, uh, I will see what I will do. I will talk to him so that he can be released. Oh. But let him not try it again, not to change and block. Thank you, Let him not go near. Please, go and boil water for me. Let me give him hot water treatment. 
Uh, I don't need any, any, any auto car. I'll be fine. Nah, please. The beating they gave you at that side, there could be clots of blood in your body now. Eh? It will help to melt some of it. Eh? Because they are no one bigger. Papa, the only injury I have right now is the injury in my heart. And that hot water will not melt that one away. So just, 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 just. Just listen to my mama. Let me make the water. Okay, mom. No come. You call up your evil. Honestly, I am sorry for everything. I am so sorry. See, I tried everything possible. Everything within my reach to help the situation. But my opinion does not count anymore. You know, I will want to have you as my son in law anytime, any day. Nothing I said or do matters anymore. My daughter, Gucci, and my husband seems to have forgotten everything. But I still remember. I will always remember. My son. I will not forget you. No, not in a hurry. Today, I want to pray for you, my son. I pray for you as a son I gave birth from my own womb. God in heaven, the same God we all call, will heal your heart. Amen. He will mend your heart. Amen. He will give you another girl, beautiful, that will love you as much as you will love her. Amen. Weep no more, my son. Please. Okay. The cross you are carrying is not only you. How so bad is it pain in my heart? It's okay. You know, go. Okay, you move up. It's okay. Move your hands. Okay. okay. Please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My son, you've been here all day. Your sister said you have not eaten anything since morning. Eh? Please, let's go inside so that you can eat your food. Oh, mom. Be go. Okay, Chupo. Mama, I am not hungry. You Mama, are not hungry. That's what he has been saying since morning. You are not hungry. He hasn't even taken water. Okay, Chupo, you are not hungry. Moving like this will not help you. If you like, mourn yourself to death. Gochi, she has left and she's not coming back. Tell him, kill yourself in case you don't know. Kill yourself, she wouldn't care. She's gone. Not even a glance back at you. Be gone. Mama, like I said, I am not hungry. When I am hungry, I will come and eat. Kechko, you'll be sick like this. The way you're going, you'll be sick. I just wish that death would just come and take me away right now. God forbid. Will you stop talking bullshit? Do you want to die? Do you want to kill yourself because one woman? Look, there are millions of women out there for crying out loud. I agree. But to go through is one woman out of that millions. Well, I don't blame you because you don't understand what we share. We have come a long way and we, we have made lots of sacrifices together. 
That girl meant everything to me. I don't know. I know. But that was in the past. I agree with you, but I cannot just accept it. I wonder what went wrong. Uguchi was everything to me. I don't know why. I never knew she would just treat me like this. You know, there is something about Uguchi you don't understand. Let me ask you. Have you ever wondered why I got admission before Ugochi, but she graduated before me? Now let me tell you. Although I have not told anyone this before, her family are aware. I just told my mom of recent. You see, I I dropped out from school so that Ugochi can finish her school. Just a year after Ogochi got her admission, things became very rough for them. I had to sacrifice. I was happy doing it because I trusted Ogochi. We were in love. But I, I, I didn't know she was going to betray me. I recently heard you turn down a proposal from a boy and you almost deleted one of your eyes for her. Man, woman can be unpredictable. But I will tell you, there is nothing you can do about it. She has moved on. So I advise you this end. You see, look, in my place, in the city, I have enough space. So I advise you to move with me to the city get a job, then you plan for the next thing. That is if you're ready to move on. So I think that's the best I can do for you as a friend. Thank you. Thank you. My son, I had Ugochi arrive the village today with a car back about for her. After shopping for her traditional marriage. From all indications, my son, this girl has moved on. She doesn't care what you do to yourself. She can go ahead and commit suicide. It will not change anything. But a wise young man will pick up the pieces of his life and move on. And the good thing is that Onyeka, your friend, told me has offered you a shelter in his place in the city. So I will advise you follow him hmm? and fix up your life. There are millions of girls out there better than Ogochi that will appreciate you and value you for who you are and what you are. My son, forget to get you, Ogochi. She's in your past. Your past and will remain in your past. Face your future head on. Oh, Oh, one because. Mama. My son. Take good care of him for me. <laughs> Mama, you don't have to worry. I will take good care of him. Hey, He's what? my friend. <laughs> <laughs> I will take care of ourselves. Don't worry, Mama. We'll be fine. I will take care of him. Mama, we need to study. Yeah. Mama, make sure you be a good girl. I hear you, brother. And don't just pray. Mama, pray. Mama, take care of yourself. Bye. All right.
Okay. You are welcome to this seat once again. Thank you. You see, like I told you, there are windows of opportunities. You know, like I say, if you seek, you shall find. And um, I believe now that you have left the place. Every bad experience and memories are forgotten. And um, I know you have been too loved by the But now you are here. Do not allow your past to affect your future. I know you've got dreams. I'm just pushing your dreams. This is the only thing I have to give to you for now. Thank you so much, Onyeka. I... I really appreciate it. I assure you I will put my past behind me and move on. I will promise you this day I will not let you down. Thank you. Thank you. This love is wonderful. Oh, we are breakable, but you love for the love you more. This love is magical. Oh, we are breakable, but you love for the love you Thank you. <laughs> Honeymoon. Yes. Alright. Well, I trust you. I yeah. trust you. Anyone anyway, know what you can do? <laughs> Alright, we want to go in and rest. Ah, everything, everything is set. Everything. All right, it's okay. Everything. Uh, welcome. Thank ah. you. <laughs>
all observations and um, x-ray he doesn't have any broken bones or internal bleeding he's gonna be fine he just needs enough rest he's gonna be fine trust me all right okay. yeah let's clean this up okay ma What exactly is going on? Where is okay? Look at the time. 12.30 a.m. No sign of him. And his cell phone is switched off. He never told me he would be going out today. Oh God. What do I do now? I'm scared. All is not well with him. Please don't do this to me. Because if you leave me, I will survive it. I love you so much, Gucci. Please don't do this to me. Come. Oh. Gucci. Sorry, it's not to Gucci. Where am I? You are in the hospital. You've been unconscious for two days now. You ran into my car. I don't know what you were thinking. And I didn't find any ID card, no phone on you. I couldn't contact any member of your family. Oh. But I can remember I left the house with my phone. How do you think I lost it in the scene? Maybe. Oh, please. Do you have your phone with you? Yes. Can I give you my friend's number so you can Um, you're his friend? Yes. What happened to him? Um, he ran into my car. He was completely lost. I don't know what he was thinking. Um, he has been unconscious for two days now. So there was no way I could contact you or any member of his family to come over. He just woke up like a few minutes ago and I was able to get your number from him. Oh, thank you so very much for bringing him here. You know, I was so worried when I couldn't reach him. I was at home when he left, so I had no idea. So how is he now? Um, the doctor said he's fine. <sighs> Thank God, because he has taken like two of my working days. Sorry, so, so sorry. Okay. It's okay. So it's okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome.
So this is it. The ghost of a broken relationship is really haunting him so bad that he has lost um, interest in living. I have tried everything humanly possible to make him understand that he can still live. But he's not working. But I think uh, maybe because he's unemployed, so nothing is applying his mind. I mean, he's a graduate. Yes. He's a first class uh, degree holder in BZME. Uh, really? Yes. So, how come he's still unemployed? Where is you for this country? <laughs> Funny. Wow. Alright, I pray God will provide the job for him very soon. Amen. No. Uh, I have to be on my way now. Please just take care of him very well, okay? okay. I will come and see him later today. Alright. Hmm? Take care of yourself. I will. Thank you. Um, did you say your patient is fine? <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> patient. Uh, he's your patient. Uh, you have attended to him more than the doctor since the past three days. Mm. Dad, that was because I was so scared. Mm. Do you know the trauma that boy put me through? God, it would have been worse if he died. Um, I understand, my dear. Hmm. Um, did you say he ran into your car? Yeah, he did. Did he tell you why he wanted to commit suicide? The love of his life left him and he found life so miserable. His friends say that he has tried everything possible to take him out of that situation, but everything he does is just useless. Um, I, I pity for him though. I wish there's something I can do for him. Mm. When is he going to be discharged? Mm -hmm. Day after tomorrow. Day after tomorrow? Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Tell him I want to see him. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, that. Okay, my dear. So, how was the day today? Not too bad. For bringing you here. <laughs> Thank you, really. Mm. And that reminds me, you've not told me your name. Okay, my name is Sophia. Sophia, what a beautiful name for a beautiful princess. You see, Sophia, your heart is as pure as your name. You know, to some people, they would have just abandoned him in the middle of the road, since he was the one that ran into the vehicle, but. You took it upon yourself, you brought him here, and even paid the bees. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And yeah, by the way, my daddy wants to see you. Hey, my son, make yourself comfortable. Thank you. And tell us what we offer you. We have wine or in sorted, and even food. There's food. Uh, that is water. Water? Yes. Mm, okay. Sophia, get him water. Mm. <laughs> okay. My son. What was it? Was it that you lost a loved one? A job? 
or what you have labored for in life that made you to take your you want to take your life. it feels you see son as I told you earlier suicide is never an option at all the best revenge you can ever give to whosoever that does not wish you well is success pick yourself up work hard be successful then your revenge is complete. My dear, I had a similar experience. In two good occasions, I had wanted to take my life. But God, in His infinite mercy, preserved my life. You won't believe it. The woman in question later came back on her knees begging. That was when I realized that I played a fool that time. Had it been I committed that suicide, what would have happened now? I would have been the man I am today. I wouldn't have gotten this world. My beautiful Sophia wouldn't have been there. Who would have taken you to the hospital? These are the things you will realize that it's only the cowards that commit suicide because of heartbreak. Hmm? If I were you, I would have just forgotten the issue of the past. First tomorrow, that's first the future. Tomorrow will always be a better day. Thank you so much, sir. Mm. Thank you so much, sir. Okay, my best. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. And what will I get from this piece of advice? What was my dad telling you inside there? <laughs> you really want to know? Yes. Yeah. I'm sure he wasn't scolding you for the stress he put me through. Scolding me? On the contrary, your dad just brought back a dead man to life. I didn't know my dad as such a messiah. No, I am serious. He's such an amazing man. I have never seen a man like your dad eat before in my life. Wow, yes. dad is flattered. No, 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 no. <laughs> he really inspired me a lot. I mean, people are amazing. I like you guys. Hmm. I know dad likes you, but I do not know why I don't like you. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad's nice, I enjoyed it. Okay. Hello. Thank you, my darling. You're yeah. Welcome. Yeah. <laughs> my dear, you look exactly like your mother. Her sense of humor, her beauty, her everything. I miss her more 
I'm happy she's with her people right now. Hmm? Are you checking? Yes, sir, it is. So, what did you tell Okechuku okay, today because he felt so rejuvenated when he was leaving? Or, did you promise him that you're going to give me out to him in marriage? <laughs> 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 oh, oh, oh. Oh, Sophia, please stop this. I don't have this friend to laugh. Mm. You sure know how to raise sad hearts. <laughs> please, please. Mm. Uh, um, uh, I, I just want to know what you told him. Um, well, I told him what he's supposed to know uh, to make his life start up again. Okay. Uh, um, it, you said something about him earlier. What exactly? Uh, something about his uh, academic qualification and his unemployment status. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. His friend um, mentioned that he's a first-class degree holder in business administration, and he is yet unemployed. And so? So, Dad, don't you think we need the services in the company? <laughs> Sophia. You barely know this young man, huh? and uh, you, uh, I'm sure you know that the company doesn't uh, employ anybody anyhow. Dad, just get the board to fix an interview for him. That will do. Okay, granted. <laughs> Thank you, Dad. Okay. I love you. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oyeka, hey! Today is a great day. I have good news. Listen, I went to Sophia's father's company for an interview and I got the job. You don't mean it. I am telling you the truth. Oh my God. I'm hey! For you! My man! God is alive. Wait a minute. Have you seen Oye company? Yes! Sophia's father is the owner, the CEO of that company. That man is a billionaire. Okay. Hey! A celebration. A big celebration. Hey! Jesus. I am telling you. I told you. God has finally assigned me. <laughs> Let's go. Please go. Let's enjoy ourselves. <laughs> this life is a teacher. What kept you so long? I'm sorry, honey. It was this uh, phone conversation I had with a business partner. Honey, it seems I'll be leaving for the United States. What? In fact, my flight ticket has already been booked. Are you just telling me? Honey, it's not like that. It just came up. It is an important business trip that I must make. Oh, God. Why every time? Why? I never have you in this house. So, how long are you going to stay? I am not going to stay long. Maybe one or two weeks. Two weeks is far. Honey, it's okay. I'm sorry, okay? Hi. It's okay. I'm sorry. I know we just got married. I know that we're supposed to have enough time together. But you and I know that we need this money. Honey, okay. When I come back, we are going to have enough time together, okay? I promise. Meanwhile, let me transfer some money into your account to enable you to have enough money to spend, okay? Come on, put on a smile. I can't, I can't fake it. I'm not happy. Oh, come on. I'll be back before you... What is that? Peter. Oh, Peter, come in. It's okay. Um, there's a fire. Peter. Yes, bro. Go and tell the driver to get ready. Mm. We'll be going to the airport right away. It's like you're traveling. Oh, yes. And please take good care of my wife. I am not a kid. I can comfortably take care of myself. You are telling Peter that he hasn't taken good care of himself to take care of me. Bro, I don't mind now, okay? You just placed her in a good hand. 
I will take good care of her. It's all right. <laughs> Sweetheart? Mm. Oh boy. See as God just carried this place. Dash! <laughs> now, I don't even know how to explain it. I don't know what I have done for God to give me this kind of thing. But I just know God is awesome. And all thanks to you guys. I think you should you should thank Sophia the more because she's the reason for this. You're right. Yeah. God bless that girl. By the way, do you do you guys communicate often? Um yes. But since I resume in this office I have not seen her. But she called. And she's on her way to this place. Oh, really? Yes. That's so nice. Uh, she is a bit ah, talk of the death. <laughs> <laughs> Hey! Welcome, pretty. Hi, Rebecca. You're welcome. How are you? Very fine. You're welcome. Hey, come on. I, I was not even expecting it to be like this. All thanks to you. Mm. I owe you one. Hmm. You know, I like it when people say they owe me. Why don't you prove it by buying me a drink? A drink? Yeah. <laughs> Just a drink. <laughs> I can do more than a drink. That's all yes. I ask for, a drink. So, He's not listen, <laughs> listen. He's not going to just buy you a drink. He's gonna buy the bar. And I'll show that. What are you waiting for? Hey, let's go. <laughs> come on, come on. Cheers to what? It's a good life. Long life, prosperity. Man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. More money. You can say that again. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So, how has it been working with the company? Well, it has been great. They are lovely people. They are very friendly. I think I like it there. And you don't find it a bit stressful at all? Stressful? I have spent years studying and I'm expecting this to happen. Now that I have it, you're talking about stressful. I am enjoying it. It's exciting. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Wait a minute. Ah, uh, I see. Onyeka, my friend, has been talking too much, right? <laughs> Onyeka? Yes. Wow. <laughs> While you were in the hospital bed, you were hallucinating about Uguchi. You mentioned her name a couple of times. You thought I was Uguchi, actually. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I guess it was a terrible experience. Mm. So, tell me about it. What? Tell me about it. Oh, please, I really do not want to talk about it. It's 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 history now. I'm fine. Sorry, I'm sorry, one minute. Hello? Yes, sir. I am right here. Just send them out. I'll go through them. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Mr. Uzo is supposed to. The appointment is for 10 o'clock tomorrow, not today. I told you. 10 a.m. in the morning, yes. All right, thank you. I'm sorry, can I say something? Yeah. <laughs> I was um, saying we should get to the cafeteria and get lunch. Seriously, I would have loved to. But as it is now, I have lots of work in my hands and I just... Sorry. Yeah, huh? No, not now. In two hours. Yes. Alright, thank you very much. So, maybe... Some other time. I do. Certainly understand. I really hope you understand. 
okay. Maybe some other time. All right, I'll just go. Sorry. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay, just give me the right number. One two four. FX three four one. All right, no problem. I'll send them. Guy, how are you today? Well, uh, Majesty, I am fine. How are you? I'm fine. I hope you didn't stress yourself much at work today. No. Are you sure about that? You know I can make inquiries. Oh, oh, oh before you do that, I have Kitty. I had a busy day at the office today, but I am back home and having a good rest. So. Okay, that's nice. I just wanted to check up on you before I go to bed. Um, try and have a good night rest, okay? Sure, thank you so much. You're a good friend. I appreciate it. You too. Bye. So, Dad, do you want to have dinner right now? No, no. I think a little of my wine will do for now. Oh, okay. Mm. I, I have, um, uh, Sophia, that friend of yours is extremely outstanding. I have closely assessed him. He looks like one who has a lot to offer this company. Oh, yeah. Um, Mr. Kechuku is a very hardworking man. Even the director attested that the other day. Uh, <laughs> talking about the director, in the light of his retirement this week, uh, he specifically, you know, recommended the young man as his successor. Wow, he did? Yes, he did. What do you think? <laughs> do I rest such great responsibility on him? Do you think he has all that it takes to offer? Oh, of course, Dad. See, Okechuku is not going to disappoint you, believe me. I can assure you that. He's very hardworking. I'm, I'm sure you know about that. He's never going to disappoint you, Daddy. Mm. Please, Dad. <laughs> okay, why not go and get me my drink? Yeah. While I reflect on that. Okay, I prefer. Uh, before then, please, on the telly for me. Welcome. Honey, come on, don't give me that look. I just came back from a long journey. Obviously, you don't realize how lonely I have been in this house. I know, honey, I know. And I am sorry. But there is something you should know. I go out there to look for money for both of us. You know that money has to be made, remember? But all the same, I am sorry. I am back now and I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Now, can you put on a smile on that beautiful face? Come on. Oh, that is better. Oni, I am very hungry. Can you go and get me something to eat? I've missed your delicious meals. <laughs> Anderson? Seriously? What do we do now? Presently, I'm in Nigeria. Of course, I know that my presence is needed, but... It's okay, it's alright. 
I'll be in China in 48 hours. Yes. Of course you can trust me on these. Everything will be taken care of. Okay then. Bye. Darling, what was that? I hope you're not angry with me because I want to travel again. Of course I should be very happy with you. You came back from the United States just two nights ago. And now, you're planning to travel to China. Oh, I'm super excited. I'm happy. Honey, I perfectly understand how you feel. But you need to know that I am an international businessman. Every business trip, every business appointment I miss there, I lose millions of men. And that is not good. You know it. We need money to be complete. We need money to build a happy home. Honey, listen. I set up all these with money. And I need money to maintain them. Life is nothing without money. That's your ideology. But for me, there is more to life that gives happiness than money. Does that bother you? Of course it doesn't. Because you're a big man, you have all the money in the world. I can't stop you and I can't change anything in you. Go ahead with your business. Just, just let me be. I will be fine. Trust me, I will. Honey, let's not engage in this. It is not going to come us. I need you to understand me. That is all I have to say. Understand, you said? Have you ever understood me for once? Have you? Hey! Yes, my Okay. What were you saying on the phone today? My brother, God has done another good thing for me. You are talking to the director of Big Things Company. That's not possible. Hey, come on. For how long have you been working with this company to attend such great feat? The, the, the question is, how did it happen? I am not blaming you for asking such a question. If it's me, I will ask the same thing. My brother, I was sitting in the office when the present director just came and announced that he's retiring. I said, okay. And the next thing they asked him to recommend somebody. And he recommended me as a new director. Just like that. You don't mean it! My brother, I looked up and said, God, you are awesome. This is indeed a miracle. A miracle! A big miracle! Oh my God. My brother, I'm so happy. I, I cannot me. explain it. I'm so happy. You know you are my man. So yes. I, that's why I was calling you. I said, I must come and explain everything to you. <laughs> Listen, this enjoyment we are having today, yes. everything on me is one, is a bigger one. A bigger one. A bigger one. God has done it. <laughs> Let me just take off all these things. What did you go to the concert? 
I couldn't sleep and I was bored at the same time. And I needed someone to talk to. You mean you went to Peter's room and woke him up? No, I didn't do that. I, I met him at the sitting room. He said the mosquito in his room couldn't let him sleep. So we got chatty. Is there anything you want to tell me because I want to sleep right now? Good night. Are, they, are you ready? Oh, not again. Huh. I don't want to miss my flight. I don't know what I was doing. I just slept over. But I told you to wake me up. You skipped my mind. Okay, it's all right. I have to be at the airport in 20 minutes time. Take good care of yourself. I'll call you when I get there, okay? Ade, let's get out of here. See you, darling. This life, what kind of a husband is this? He has even forgotten that today is my birthday. Hello, our honorable managing director. Please sit down. Thank you. How majesty. Welcome <laughs> to my office. How did you find this place? Okay, quit messing around. I am no royalist. So what do you want me to call you? Her majesty? <laughs> <laughs> okay, nice office. So how has it been, Mr. Director? Well, we've been doing it. We thank God. That's not be easy, but... So we're just pushing and um, hoping that God will do something, you know? Who's distracting you? Ooh! She is sexy. Who is she? But you know you shouldn't have done that, right? Why? Who is she? That's Ugochi. Today's her birthday and um, I was just trying to upload. Just wish her a happy birthday. Seriously? I don't understand Sophia. She saw Ugochi's picture and she asked me who she is. I told her and the next thing she got angry and left just like that. Come on, what is wrong with you again? So you've not gotten over that girl? If that should be the case, you couldn't even hide it from Sophia. Hide it? What is it about Sophia? I don't get it. Oh, come on. You asking that question? 
Are you trying to tell me you don't know that this girl Sophia has something very deep for you? Oh, you can't see it. So bad. Gucci has really, has really damaged your heart. Well, listen up, friend. Let me tell you something. Don't allow that to blind your eyes from appreciating other hearts that love you. That's my only piece of advice. Yes. Are you serious? Wow, I hope it was successful. Oh, thank God. I'm so happy for you. No, 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 I'm happy for us. Yes. <laughs> I guess you're done now. So, tell me, when will I be expecting you? What? You'll be traveling to Hong Kong? But how? Why? We never discussed that. Urgent? Not again, not again, not again. Okay, fine. How long are you going to spend there? You're kidding me. You're not serious. of bondage is this? Is this marriage? No. No. What the hell are you doing here? 
No, you are wrong. You shouldn't be apologizing to me. You should be sorry for your pathetic self. Oh yes, I am pathetic. As a matter of fact, I am one pathetic fellow who has failed to erase his past and his present. See, the only real and good thing I am seeing in my life right now is you standing in front of me. But I have failed to recognize that. I am sorry. I have failed to appreciate everything you've done for me. But I promise you, I will be the man that you want me to be. Just forgive me. Please. You know, I was thinking, I I have a day off today. I, I, if you don't mind, I could give you a treat. I'm sorry. It's, it's okay. It's okay. So, how have you been? Just here. I was about going out. Uh, um, okay. We will just go out in one car, right? Okay. Yours, mine. No, it has to be mine then. <laughs> okay, no problem. Yeah. God. <laughs> What's the secret, Sophia? Hey, you just got me there. But you know I cannot lie to you now. It is Sophia. That's it. You see, Sophia is the key. Man, look at you. You are important. You see, um, I don't know. I don't know how she has made me feel. It, it, sometimes I just feel like she's using voodoo on me. Because I can't take her off my mind. She has captured my heart. That's it, bro. Sophia is the key. Mm. Man, look at you. You are reborn. <laughs> yes, you can say that again. But the truth is, I am scared. Judging from where I am coming from, you know how it is. I mean, I am just scared of another heartbreak. I don't know. You see, I understand pretty well. But I understand Sophia is different. You see, for a little time I've known her, I think you know how to be afraid of getting in trouble with her. She 
has a stronger feeling, I believe, against it. It's okay if you say so, man. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure it will. <laughs> yeah, did a good life, bro. <laughs> Um, it's me, Peter. The driver is ready. He's ready? Yes. Alright, I'll put you shopping. Hey, wait, wait, Peter. Please come. Come help me do this, please. Okay. Come in. Oh. Hello? Inspector Paul? Yeah, this is Chufubaka. I want you to come with your men to my house this minute. Listen, if I don't see you here in the next 15 minutes, I will commit murder. And you will be held responsible for it. And as for you, by the time I am done with you, you will decide to leave or commit suicide. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, shut Shut up! Shut up! Hey. Don't even say a word! Oh. everything to me. You have brought so much joy into my heart. I cannot express how I feel about you and I want to use this opportunity to ask you. Please, Sophia. Marry me. Sophia, there's a ring before you. Oh my god. I, I didn't see that coming. I didn't see that coming. Um, okay. Please get up. I'm engaged to someone else. What? What? How do you mean? Now tell me, what's the meaning of the green light you've been showing to him then? I am so sorry that you've been getting everything wrong. I was just trying to help out a young man with a bright future. I didn't know I was sending the wrong signals to you. I am so sorry. Okay, please just forgive me. Mark, my fiancé, is already in town and we're planning for our wedding. I I'm so sorry. I, I, I was just helping her because I've been through heartbreak and I know how it feels like and I didn't want to see you go through them, that lane. Please just 
Forgive me. I'm, I'm so sorry for sending the wrong signals. Please. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, Peter. Tell me that what you just said to me is a lie. No, 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 okay. Peter, I want you to be sincere to me. I hope you're not telling me all this because my husband kept you in the police cell for three weeks now. I hope you're not lying to me. No. 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 Go ahead, I'm all ears. Are you impotent? Who told you that? It doesn't matter who told me. All I need is answers to my question. Are you impotent? Yes or no? Oh. Obaka. So it's true. You are impotent and you kept it away from me all this while. And you call yourself my husband? How cruel can you be? How dare you? And so what if I am impotent? Is it a new thing? <sighs> we can as well go to the orphanage home and adopt children if that is your fear. Over my dead body. Over my dead body would that ever happen? If that is your plan then you have failed. How Ogo. terrible can you be? Ogo, can I ask you a question? What? Are you tired of this marriage? Do you need a soothsayer to tell you that I'm officially tired? I am tired of you! I am tired of this house! I am tired of this marriage! You can as well go to hell and burn to ashes for all I care. I am equally not interested in this marriage again. Get out! Then it's fine. Now listen to me. Go in there, pack your things, and go back to your father's house. I can marry as many wives as I want. I am Chief Ubaka. I am the richest man in Ozubolo Kingdom. There is nothing my money cannot do for me. Get out! And who wants to remain here? I said get I'm out! I'm leaving! Get I'm out! I'm leaving! Out! I am leaving! Out! Please! Excuse me! What errant nonsense. Why now? Why now? Eh? I told you I have plans. I have plans. You should have waited. You should have waited for me to exhibit my plans. Eh? You, 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 you. Come on, shut up, this planless idiot. 
Bro, no, 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 Mama. You cannot spoil my plan. I still have plans. You cannot spoil it. I said shut up. I will come here. That's what you are. Like father, like son. The chivalrous things. I'm not saying mom yours. Man, I never saw that coming. Why would women be so unpredictable? I don't know. Maybe I am not just lucky when it comes to women. No, 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 no. Don't say that. Don't say that. There's a white girl out there for you. So don't let all this discourage you. But the thing is, if. Excuse me. Hello, Ifoma. What? Ma is sick? Ah, is it that serious? Uh, but I hope she has taken medication. Alright, um, I'll come to the village tomorrow. Please take care of her. Alright, bye. It's my sister. I said my. My mother is sick and it's very serious. So, what's the plan? Go back to the um, Yeah, and also I've been thinking. I, I think I need to bring them to the city. They will just stay with me permanently. After all, I, I stay in this house all alone, so... Oh, this is my car. I am telling you, look at this. Go around. God has blessed me. In fact, this song is dedicated to me. I am telling you, check it. Hey! 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 Mama, why are you crying now? It's okay. Let's be happy, but okay, it's back. Come on, don't worry, don't worry. Eh? Our story has changed. Come, let's go inside. <laughs> it's okay. Eh? You're supposed to be happy. <laughs> or should I consider this one as a tears of joy? <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Hey. Oh man, didn't I tell you? I tell you, see, this guy will make it. He's back in this village now with a very big car. You see the way I'm keeping my hand? That is the way, the size of the car. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. And yeah, and yeah. So, how are that supposed to be my business? Gimme. See, see, see. Let's say you don't get handwork, Abby. Me? Go back to your house. Come on. Go back to your house. Wait, wait. If you go, it's okay. It's okay. Okay, you know very well now. Your ex boyfriend. Don't mind him. Don't mind him. Look at you. Talk. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait now. Must you talk all the time? Allow me to listen. Ah, please. Are you talking about Okichu? Okay. Your ex boyfriend is in this village now with a very big car. And his purpose of coming to this village is to take his uh, mother, take his uh, sister, take them to the city. They will be staying with him permanent in that city. Okay has a very big company. If you see his company, eh? Okay has a, a, a place of cars. Any name you think you can mention, mention it. Uh, okay has this one they call the, uh, 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 is it uh, Venza? Okay has a, a spider. Even, uh, 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 is it this one, uh, uh, the video boss for your, his girlfriend? Okay has it. I'm telling you. Wait, 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 wait. How did you know all this? Who told you? Oh I received information in this city. A village I receive in the city. Yes, now because I have plans. We have plans. These are plans that is one year now we have not seen these plans. Hey, brother. Hmm? Did you hear what happened to go to your ex girlfriend? Ah. 
sans les wakouté. Po, 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 po. C'est pas. 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 She's in the village. This is her village. But she's, she should be in her husband's house. We'll back her through out of the house now. You're happy now. Mama, is it true? And nah, it's true. Hey, it's true. to cry yourself to death since you came back to this house all you do is cry and mourn yourself every day you're not doing any good to yourself oh. mama is this life is this thing i'm living life uh -uh. mama my life is of no use <laughs> it's of no use to me right now please don't sound like that it was no two don't sound like that there is always a reason for what to live Shattered. I'm in a deep pain right now. Look at me. I destroyed my life from the very first day I ended my relationship with Ogechuku. <laughs> and ever since then, I've known no peace till now. And I don't think I will ever be happy. No, you will. Look at what I brought upon myself. It's okay. Maybe you should just go and ask for his forgiveness. Eh? That is the only way your heart will find peace again. Forgiveness. Eh? Mama, don't even go there. Okay, Chuku will kill me if I ever get close to him. Mama, I've hurt him so much. I don't deserve his forgiveness. I know that. I really hurt him. After all the love he showed to me. Mama, it was Papa that destroyed my life. Papa told me that Okay, Chuku is cursed. That we do not even have any future together. <laughs> Papa said to me that there is an ancestral curse upon his family. <laughs> Mama, look at what Papa has done to me. Hey! <laughs> I thought as much. I'm a little limb that there's something wrong. That you heard something. I asked you. I know you heard something, my daughter. But you refuse to relate with me. I know how much you mean to him. So your sudden change you really shocked me. Hey, Chineke, my daughter, let me tell you. If you go from that very first day you accepted to marry Chifubaka, I have not been a happy woman. <laughs> I have not been a happy woman at all. Starting from that very first day you accepted to marry Chifubaka. <laughs> my daughter, see, money may be good in life, but it will still not give you all the happiness you desire. It will not give you peace. It will not give you rest. Ah, okay, Chuku is the only young man my heart accepts for you. So the way you treated him really hurt me. Biko, just go and apologize to him. Okay? Mama, it's not that easy. Mama, I don't know. I don't know, but I believe so much in my heart that okay, Chuku will never forgive me. Okay, Chuku is a nice man. It's okay, my daughter. Okay, Chuku is a nice man, and I'm sure he will listen to you. Biko. Okay, my daughter. It's okay. It's okay. Don't you can. I can't do it. You just find a way. You find a way.
I know. I know I've wronged you. I know I've wronged you so badly. I am here to ask for your forgiveness. Please, forgive me. I am not even worthy to stand before you. I know I don't even deserve your forgiveness, but believe me, I have known no peace ever since I left you. My life has not been nice at all. It wasn't my doing, it was my father's. My father, my father did everything. He lied about your family. He said you guys were cursed. And he said if I don't leave you, that he would disown me. It wasn't entirely my fault. If I'm a big corner. Please forgive me. I just want to, to witness peace ever once in my life again. I'm a big corner. Please beg your brother, forgive me. If you forgive me, I will be happy. I have not been happy. If you my forgiveness that you want, uh, you will never get it. Hell. If you know what is good for you, take this your stupid self out of this compound but, before I strangle you to death. No, 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 you can't do that to me, okay, Chukubiko, no. It's best you strangle me. Okay, one man, I'm walking, If you let me leave this place, I will die. Please, yeah. Is that your plan? <laughs> See, I will tap the mother. Take yourself out of this compound. I am warning you now. Please, okay, Chukubi, I'm not going anywhere. I go, Chukubi. If, if you don't forgive me, I will commit suicide. If I'm a big one, if I'm a big one, I'm a big one. Please, kill me. Kill me, please. I'm ready to die. Please, you push you kill me. I'm not Stand doing up. it. I'm not going, please. I know you're ready to die. Go and die in your compound. Please. I'll, I'll teach you. If you don't forgive me, I will commit suicide. You commit suicide? Yes. Hey, can, you, can you do it immediately? But not here. If you go to that place, that, on that room, just kill yourself there. Because then, because then, because then, it's not good. I'm your fellow woman. It was not my fault. My father did it. I'll stop you. You're beating me. It is still. Come on, it's still who? Mono. It's still who? No one. Look at me. Oh, Mono. Oh, Mono, Bikono. Oh, Pano, Mono. Bikono. I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. I will go. I will go. Don't touch my car. Don't touch my car. Don't touch my car. Go, 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 Okay, Chuku, I can't leave this place if you don't forgive me. I can't leave this place. I can't be happy. <laughs> Remember how I loved you. It's my father. <laughs>
Mama Ogochi! Mama Ogochi! Mama Ogochi! Mama Ogochi! What? Ogochi is dead though. Okay, okay, rush in and take her cups away. I don't know where she is. Let me back. 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 What? And the girl rushed in and took her away. We thought he brought the cops here. Hey! Who got to do what? Committed suicide. Oh, oh, oh. Maybe he took her to the hospital. Which one is dead? Oh, uh, no try, you rather. Will you shut up? Oh, which yeah, mortuary? Please, which hospitals do you have here? You know, we have two hospitals in this community. Okay. Maybe he has taken her in either of them. Uh -huh. See, 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 see. see. You don't know my plans, though. I saw this with my two eyes. You know I don't spread lies. I see what I see with my very own eyes. She's dead. Mm -hmm. What is happening? You can hear me, but I want you to be fine. I I really care about you. I just I just wish you can just wake up. I am sorry for the way I treated you when you came to my house. Please. Wake up. I love you. Gucci. Oh. Gucci. Easy, 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 easy. You're fine. Easy, just easy. Come, just calm down, calm down. Calm down. Doctor! This life is a teacher 